for this experiment we're going to need dish soap, warm water with some kind of container and most important dry ice let's get to our experiment so first we're gonna pour some soap inside of the water and then we wanna mix it up so we get the soapy water and then we're going to grab a piece of dry ice and put it into the soapy water and let's see what happens so we pretty much get in the bubble making machine you can actually now touch it with your hand that's totally safe and when you pop bubbles smoke comes out so for the kids this is, will be super fun so you grab it look and if I pop them smoke comes out fire extinguisher close by and let's get to it so I'm gonna light them up the mercury tire side And today I'm gonna show you a very cool trick slash science experiment with a coffee room, kahula and milk. Let's check it out. In one glass we're going to add milk and in another glass we're gonna add kahula coffee liquor. Then we're going to need a film like that. We're gonna put over this glass like that and flip it over and put it on uh, this glass. I'm gonna grab the glass and Put it upside down and it shouldn't spill out too much then carefully put it over this glass you see what I'm saying so make sure glasses on top of each other and then we're gonna make a little slot in between of the glasses just a really, really small one and see what happens How cool is that? And today I'm going to show you what if you try on a ring and it's gonna get stuck in your finger? How do you get it out? As you can see my finger pretty stuck over here, doesn't come off. You see how it's pretty thick over here. And it doesn't come off because of this part, skin, getting stuck over here. So how can we take it off without cutting it? All we need is elastic band like that. And you can grab it from the mask or stuff like that. You know, a lot of places have those ones, especially in the emergency room and stuff. What you're gonna do is hold it like that. If you don't have assistance, you, you can do it yourself. And just kind of make it tight. And little by little, go up to the ring. So little by little, you see how skin getting pushed down. And then after you wrapped up the finger, what you want to do is grab the scissors and push through the, the, uh, the ring, under the ring. And just like pull it up. And what's going to happen once we're going to unbend it, you see how skin stacks here, but the ring is like twig like you see twitches and going down and the rubber band holding the skin all together and tight so you can take off the ring really easily check it out i just pull it out from a freezer it's not frozen or anything and then i'm gonna open it and look at this it's freeze up freeze up instantly how cool is that so I got this cork slushy. You see what I'm saying? 
Look at that slush. Awesome. Man, this glass is too small for my for my cock. Oh well. But yeah, you see what I'm saying? You got this cock slush. How cool is this? Mmm. That tastes amazing. So check it out everybody. Cock slush. And of course I'm gonna try it for you. Wow. It actually tastes good. Brain freeze. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> How to open a can? Like this just hands using only your hands. You cannot use anything. If you're like out just in the middle hands. like of a deserted island. Just like How are you gonna it? open a can? Yeah, squeeze it and open it <laughs> by yourself. You think you can do it? I, I know I can do it. How? I don't know, I don't know how yet. Okay. I know I can. I'll teach you and I'll teach you as well. Let's check it out. So what I wanna do is grab it like that and squeeze it in the middle. And like sque keep squeezing it like to the corners as much as you can as you can see it's like just like this maybe just hold it with one hand and push it shit with your thumb as much as you can and once you got it like that what you want to do put your hand like right here and like here and squeeze it push it in as much as you can as you can see we're gonna get this breaking points right here. I'm gonna squeeze it a little bit more. See if I can. As much as you can. So it's gonna look like this, you see it? This is the easiest breaking points. What we're gonna do, turn it over and do the same. Maybe put it like that in your hand, lock it in and push your finger into it. much as you can so now we're just gonna push it together wow, just like that there it comes and then turn it over Whoa. and do the same thing here kind of squirting me a little bit <laughs> <laughs> that's what she said oh then we're gonna turn it over and do the same boom <laughs> then turn it over and do the same to the point <laughs> where you're just gonna be able to do it what do you got in your shirt there four. Ew, <laughs> what kind of can is that? I don't even know. Maybe like diced tomatoes? Oh man, this is nasty. W oh, oh, is that spinach? Uh, yeah, this is spinach. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> so, but I'm gonna prove it to you guys that you can open it. You're proving it. Oh, I just got squirted with sp uh, spinach juice. <laughs> Look at my glasses. <laughs> hey. Dude, the camera is soaked. <laughs> But if you need to survive and open it, I'm oh, gonna man. show you that it's possible. Let's wipe off that camera. Let's do it. Come on. Dude, you think it's the first time? That camera has been soaked. Oh yeah, I'm sure it has. Film it? That's what she said. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so, of course... <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, here, let's get a close-up on that. You wanna continue on this thing? Just <laughs> up and down. Well, I think the best if you get the can without this kind of juice. But you want to keep squishing it like that, up and down. And as you can see, the metal is breaking. <laughs> then you want to do this kind of motion. And guess what? Oh my gosh, that's pretty. <laughs> I just that. open. Hold on, let's get a, let's see that. And I just open. <laughs> oh, that a looks, can of that, spinach. That looks delicious. For this experiment, we're going to need glass of water, empty plastic cup, saran wrap, knife or scissors, and of course dry ice. So let's check out what we're going to do. Oh yeah, and don't forget about the rubber band. What we're gonna do is grab empty cup and make a hole over here. Then I'm gonna put a few pieces of dry ice in there and put the ceramic wrap and put a rubber band on top of it. Then we're gonna grab water and put it in a glass. As you can see a lot of smokes comes out and then I'm gonna heat it with my finger right here and guess what? We're gonna see 
rinse flying. The best way to do it is put warm water in there. So you have more smoke and check it out. And I actually stay for a while. For this experiment you're gonna need a Q-tips like that. 12 of them and you wanna glue them together. As you can see I just grab it and took out all this part and glue them together and glue them together with the hot glue. It is super simple just make a square glue them together then this four and then top ones. Very simple to do. And then we're going to need soap. And now let's see the magic. So what will happen if I'm gonna dip it in soap like this like all four corners, you know? Let's check out what happened. Check it out. You see? There's four bubbles say, like that inside like a triangle bubble, you see? But can we make a square over there in the middle? Let's try it out. What I'm gonna get is bubbler and drop a small bubble inside of it. Let's see if it will work. Boom. And we actually got a square inside of it. Bubble stuck inside of this square. How cool is that? So I'm gonna show you how to make your shoes water resistant with the candle. All we need is a candle all we need is a candle and hair blow and hair dry blower, whatever you call it. Okay, let's get to it. Alright, we're going to grab the shoe and start rubbing the candle on a shoe on that material. Alright guys, check it out. This is how it's gonna look. As you see, this one have wax on it, this one doesn't. So but you see to get rid of all that wax, we're gonna blow the air dryer and like he, he put it on high heat and it's gonna disappear. Let's check it out. You see how fast it's disappear? The white stuff? What happens? It smells between every single hole in there and you won't even see the wax. Okay, I'm gonna let it cool off a little bit because right now it's very very hot and they just look a little bit darker but almost the same. First I'm gonna pour water on the one shoe that I have not put wax on and let's see what happens. As you can see water kinda stays in it. You see it's all wet now. Like right here. How about on the side? You see it's going inside and when it's like rain keep going and going it got wet a little and it's just gonna get soaked up like you see right now it's just soaking in and yep if I stick a hand the whole shoe inside is soaked in and now I'm gonna pour water on this shoe where I put the wax on Let's check it out. You see? It just pulls, pulls off. Maybe somewhere where I missed, it kind of sucks in. But look, it's all waterproof. You see water just running off the shoe like crazy. You know what I mean? Pretty awesome. I actually put two glasses on this shoe. You see how water just running off. So sh this shoe was half a glass and this shoe was two glasses. And look, this one is all wet and this one is completely dry. We're gonna grab all this dry ice about two pounds and put it inside of the water and let's see what happens how cool is this
check this out waterfall of smoke what do you think Alex? oh my god isn't what it amazing? I walked in at the best time I know <laughs> this is dry ice experiment so as you can see this smoke is cold that's why it's going down not up how fun is this? Dude, try to lay down. Let's see if I can see you or not. So lay down on the floor. All right. Like all the way flat. <laughs> wow, you disappeared. Oh my god, you almost cannot see you. Just stay there for a minute. Wow, I cannot see you. I just see the pencil a little. <laughs> can you, could you breathe there? Oh my god. Yeah, no, you can breathe, but you're just breathing like not good stuff. Oh, but no, it's, it's okay. You, you can do that. <laughs> Look at this guys, you walk in, it's ninja, you cannot see him almost at all, but yeah, you can get up, it's amazing. You said you don't want to get up? <laughs> no, <laughs> it's too much fun.